Welcome to Trading Lounge and the European Indices for the 4th of May. Not a lot to report today, um, but let's just quickly uh, glide over um, what we went over yesterday and, and uh, what we can expect today. So first of all, with the DAX here on the four hour chart, we're looking for wave four here. And this line through here is the 38.2% retracement level that we would expect the market to come back to. So it's far from that at the moment. Um, also wave fours can get rather complicated, but um, first of all, it just hasn't pulled back to that level there. Um, so it's a long way off from, from that. Um, it's possible that I could view it as wave A here and ABC for wave B here and then this move down through here as wave 1 coming back for wave 2 in the box here and then down for 3, 4 and 5. Um, I don't know that um, but what I can say is that if the 15,300 here becomes the support up here then we'll need to go long from that point. So that's where we're at with that really there's not a lot more I can add to it I mean I can look at this as an A wave a B wave here and then five waves down for waves uh, let's put that on top there where it should be um, then I could look at this as wave C down here onto this low here and then we could look at this in a bullish term here so wave C or four sitting here but it hasn't pulled all the way back but you know things strange things stranger of things have occurred so all i can say is that we should just stand aside stay neutral if the 15300 becomes the support we get a setup there we'll take it otherwise i don't want to get caught in this trap uh here for that um i won't go to the intraday because it's not going to make um much difference um uh, the way that we view this is not there's no more to say so we just really need to allow that to um, to play out and that's also the same for the stock 50 as well here so it is possible to count all of these moves down they look they appear like five waves and the, I'd like them better as five waves um, but once again we don't have as I mentioned here yesterday we don't have um, uh, a five wave move down here i mean realistically we could look at this as as wave one up here i mean that's what it's looking like and then wave two right on this low here but once again i mean it hasn't pulled back to its 38.2 percent but i suppose it's close enough in this regard um for this market but not really the dax it's a long way off um, so i just we just need to see if we're going to you know where we're going to to, to be with this um, if we take the top out here well we're forced to go long it's as simple as that um, but I just want to give this a little bit of time here because I could count that up as an A and a B and a C wave here and we could you know and we could just come straight down from that point uh, and we'll have something of this nature but I could also count it as one and two and three here and four and five taking us up here and then an ABC pattern so um, yeah, we just got to wait that out. Um, as I just mentioned, then we can look at this as 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 one and two <clears throat> and three and four. So I, I just won't know just yet, you know. And then we'll have that sort of. Well, if we do get five waves up there, well, then we'll be, you know, we can look to go long um, earlier than that taking that top out. Uh, we can always pretty much get a better trade than taking the top out. Um, we just need to be get our timing right here. So anyway, that's kind of where we at are at with this. So I don't know if I should look at this as wave one or wave B. That's that's my that's my issue. And the footsie's um, same but different. So um, <clears throat> it's the same story here as well. We're looking at this as I mean it's pretty clear to me this is five waves here. So we should see a correction and then and then this drop here. But we're just not seeing the drop. It's just sticking like chewing gum to that 7,000 so um, you know I can't go long either because we don't have the 7,000 as support because to manage our exposure or manage our risk we need we need to know what number that we're working with so we can put our stop under that and we don't have that yet you know so we're still on the front line here with, with this so there's nothing no I can't really we can't do anything here at the moment with this I mean even in the next session let's just say that it pops up and does something like that don't chase it because it will come back and check it 
you know, and then we'll find our way in here, you know, either through like that or down here further or whatever. But, um, yeah, the breakout's important, but uh, it's only part of the process. I mean, it's possible to count this here as wave one here and two here and three here and four right to that low there and then look at wave five here for that. So we still need that ABC pattern here as well after that. So it could change for this could change form. Um, but we, we just don't have the setup. There's nothing I can really say or do about it. We just have to wait. So. Um, yeah, nothing exciting to report here, ladies and gentlemen. So we'll just uh, continue to chill out on this one. Alrighty. Thanks for tuning in, though. Cheers.